I'm not gonna go against brothers with, with some bullshit videos, man. You gotta edify, you gotta edify Israel, man. Right. I'm not gonna go against brothers with, with some bullshit videos, man. You gotta edify, you gotta edify Israel, man. Right. Now, what do you think I'm gonna do when that happens? I'm gonna talk shit about. It's gonna be a, if it happens on a Tuesday night. Guess what? I'm giving these brothers a call, and we're gonna do a live show, special report. I'm not gonna go against brothers with, with some bullshit videos, man. You gotta edify, you gotta edify Israel, man. Right. I see at the main camp in, in, uh, in New York, a lot of these guys are weak. You can see it in their eyes, man. Like they don't want to do this no more. But then they're afraid to leave because we're gonna get on them. Go back to the Lord, put them to death. After and you lukewarm guys, and we keep bringing up that lukewarm thing. Mosad gonna get rid of you. This Mosad willing this year. And um, some of you might be pulled off to the side, and I'm talking about the New York camp. I don't know about the other camps, but you might be put pulled to the side. Look, brother, you you out of here? Why, brother? Because you're lukewarm, man. Okay, this is this we deal, this is the year of diligence, and you ain't diligent. So goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. But then they're afraid to leave because we're going to get on them. Now, what do you think I'm going to do when that happens? I'm going to talk shit about it. Some bullshit videos, man. You got to edify, you got to edify Israel, man. Right. Shalom, shalom, all praise to Yahweh Bashim Yahashai. All praises again to the Heavenly Father through the name of His Son, man. Yeah, we, 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 we keep trying to reiterate and break this thing down to you, brothers, but you don't want to see it. And a lot of times, these brothers are going out there condemning themselves with their own mouths, condemning their elders, and they're too much of hypocrites to see it. You got this dude up here twisting the scripture up, twisting up simple things like in season, out of season, twisting up simple things like being lukewarm. It shows you the lack of spiritual understanding. See, brothers are so stuck in the word that they, they have lacked that spiritual understanding. They reading them texts, but they can't even understand it because that spiritual connection ain't on them. And they sit here and have you ruin your family, ruin your soul, and the next brother, and you're not cognitive and conscious enough to see it. That's why we make these videos. We don't care. I don't care about you brothers making fun of me. I don't care about you brothers talking all that smack about me. I try not to get offended because this is all for the sake of edification and brothers and sisters waking up out of that slumber but a lot of these brothers won't wake up and for those brothers we are not to care for all we can do is keep extending the love the grace and the charity of our heavenly father that he gave us through his son and for the brothers that can't receive that well they will fall by the wayside and they will ultimately uh, receive their destruction that they want brothers is always talking about death diligence and destruction where well, you diligently going to be destroyed for all of the death that you preach that's the thing the Most High is starting something new in this in this uh, so-called truth, man. And, and what this newness is is the establishment of the true gospel, which brothers don't understand. Brothers, a lot of you tell you the gospel is knowing you're an Israelite. The uh, gospel is knowing you're going to be rich in the kingdom. That's something that everybody know about heaven. Even a baby knows that heaven is supposed to be something great. Are they getting your spirits right? Question of the day.